What's up, beauty gang? It's your girl Shinsky Trine, and I'm back with another video. Today, I'm going to be talking to the everyday natural. I'm going to share with you guys the best products that I use for my 4C natural hair. Welcome back. So today I'm going to be talking to the Everyday Natural. I'm going to share with you guys some of my favorite products and what I consider to be the best products on my 4C Natural hair. As you'll notice in this video, there will not be any shampoos or conditioners. I'm going to do a separate video on that. So if you want to see what shampoos and conditioners I feel are best on my 4C Natural hair, then stay tuned for that. Let's address some of the basics. So if you are new to my channel, then welcome. Welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and comment down below and let me know that you guys are here. If you are a returning subscriber, then hey girl, welcome back. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and jump right into this video because I know my natural girls are like, what in the world are we taking so long for? Now that we have welcomed everyone, let's go ahead and jump right on into this video. So you're a 4C natural, you just got done washing your hair and you're like, what on earth am I supposed to do with this now? So of course, the first thing that every natural needs is water. And I'm telling you, it may be cliche, but you cannot tackle 4C natural hair without this, okay? Warm water for a low porosity girls like me. So now we're gonna move on to leave-in conditioners. I have three that I absolutely love. My first, oh, my absolute favorite is this, and as you can tell, it's already half empty, so I need to go get another one, but with all this coronavirus stuff going on, I may just be S-O-L, okay? But this is the Cream of Nature Argan Oil um, from Morocco. It is strength and shine leave-in conditioner. You have to shake it to activate it. That's how you know it really works, okay? This product alone works as a really great moisturizer for my hair. It instantly gets my hair really soft, really curly, with water, of course. And then sometimes when I wake up, like if I have a puff like this, I won't even put water on it if I know I'm like about to go outside or something and I don't want to get sick. I won't put water on it. I'll just use this and just spray it on my puff, pick it out a little bit, and it revives it just like that. And it's this is a staple in your everyday natural uh, for 4 c hair. This is a staple. I would highly recommend this product. My second quick and easy everyday favorite is this Kiki Curly Not Today, okay? K-N-O-T, Not Today. This product is really, really, really good. It brings my curls out. Like if you wanna quickly define your curls, again, I'm gonna refer to the puff because that's like my quickest go-to style. Um, you wanna like re uh, redefine your curls, this is the product for you. You can mix it with this product, like I said, you can mix these two together or you can just use it with water. Do a quick spritz, get this, put it in, moisturize it. Pick out your puff and you are on your way. This is another staple in my everyday natural hair routine and it's quick and easy to use. I have not used this with like a twist out or anything like that, but I'm sure it would work because it's really good at defining your curls. And this is a natural leave in slash detangler, hence the name not today. Um, it's really good, really, really good. And I highly recommend this as well. Moving on to my third favorite, this is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Leave-In Conditioner. Um, so this is Strengthen and Restore Leave-In Conditioner. It has shea butter, peppermint, and apple cider vinegar. This is a, this is also a great uh, a great leave-in conditioner for your hair. I use this one as well. I broke the top because I dropped it in the shower. Um, but as you can see, I'm already like three fourths done really good and smells really good it has a um a strong kind of well i don't say 
too strong, but you can smell the peppermint um, in it. But this is a really, really, really good leave-in conditioner and it smells really well and I highly recommend this as well. And I guess I should also mention that these products are really, really cheap, really affordable. You can find these at Walmart, Target, or on Amazon, you know how you know your girl lovers from Amazon, okay? You can find it on there. And of course, these products are sulfate free and color safe. So if you guys have any color in your hair, I used to have color in my hair not too long ago, maybe about a month ago. Um, so these products work really well when I have the color in my hair and when I, you know, obviously when I do not. So really good products. Highly recommend this. I will link all these products down below in the description box so that you guys can easily find them. But those are my three favorite leave-in conditioners. So now we're gonna move on to my scalp. So I have one of my favorite products that I use for my scalp. I have really dry scalp sometimes and I need oil-based products. I can't go put the grease on my scalp unless I have like brace or something, but I need like oil-based moisturizers for my scalp scalp something lightweight something that's not going to clog my scalp up um you know just something that's easy to wash out when it comes down to wash day so my favorite and it look a little jacked up so don't judge me but this is the Talia YG healing oil it was nine dollars and 49 cents from my local beauty supply store very very affordable and her line alone is really good I did a review on her products previously before I'll link it down below in the description box and I'll put it up here somewhere um, but it is her line is amazing and this oil um, let me tell you so yes this is tape i put around it um see what had happened was somehow some way i cracked the top right here i don't know if you guys can see that but there's a crack like a split on the top and um whenever i would pour the oil out it would come out of that crack before it came out of here so i put a uh, tape around it and yes yeah, very sticky very messy but it's i still got some use some in here and as you can see i only have a little bit of that too i'm running out of stuff but this lasted me for a while i've had this for about a year now and then the good thing about her products not to like brag on this particular product but you can use it on your hair and your body her oils are made for hair and body um and it's all natural so it says vitamin e natural hair and body oil softens and moisturizes adds sheen and eliminates dryness in that it does um i have not used it on my body i only use it on my hair but this is a um, really good product that also smells really really good so i highly recommend this to all my dry scalp girls you know because we we be needing stuff you know and like I said, it doesn't clog up your pores. It's not too greasy, not too thick, just a lightweight oil, a good lightweight oil that you can use on your scalp. So another staple. Now we're gonna get into our moisturizers. You guys, I cannot stress this enough. 4C hair girls need to keep their hair moisturized, okay? And so I have three here that I'm gonna share with you guys. So my first one, and I've mentioned this before in plenty of videos before that I've done, is the Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Why did I go blank? I use this all the time, I recommend it all the time. But this right here, you guys, this is a great moisturizer alone. Like, you don't even need to use water with this. It is so great. I love, 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 love this moisturizer okay i have like four of these in my bathroom because i'm always racking up on them before i can even get done with one but as you can see in this particular one i only have again like one fourth left of the container so i use it a lot and it smells so 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 very good i absolutely love this let's see it's coconut and hibiscus with silk protein and neem oil for thick curly hair it is an anti-frizz moisture and shine sulfate free and color safe like i said product prices range on this one i've gotten it for like six dollars i've gotten it for nine and i've gotten it for 12. so um i guess it just depends on 
where you go to get it, when you go to get it, and if they have any sales going on. I know Shea, Mo uh, Shea Moisture does a lot of different sales at Walgreens, often throughout the year, so you can go and catch a good sale on, on products of Shea Moisture. That product in particular is really, really good, and I highly, highly, highly recommend that as well. My next favorite moisturizer, uh, moisturizer is the Joyco Moisture Recovery. This product right here is a bit expensive. It's about $15 for this uh, little lotion size bottle. Don't let the tallness fool you. It is very, very thin and it's not that much. It, you will go through this really, really quickly. It is a treatment balm for thick, coarse, dry hair. I always get this from TJ Maxx. I have to go and hunt on the shelves and find this product. This product, let me tell you, let me just tell you, this product will take you from 4C to 4A like that. It's really, really good and it does what it says, moisture recovery. If you are going to the gym or something and you wanna rock your hair like this and you don't wanna sweat it out and be walking around looking like Florida oh Evans, my this, God. this is the product for you because once you you know sweat and stuff, your curls are still gonna be really, really defined. And then if you just wanna use it on a regular day basis like I was doing, this is the product for you. It's really, really, really good. Some other companies could take notes from this product. I'm just saying. And my third favorite moisturizer is the Cantu Shea Butter Daily Oil Moisturizer. I'm not sure how much this is. I do not use this as much. So I use this as a moisturizer on my like blown out hair when it's in a blown out state or on like semi straight hair or either straight hair. This moisturizer does not necessarily like define my curls in any way it also kind of like sits on the surface of my curls instead of like actually penetrating through so that is why i use it on my straight hair or blown out hair but it's also a really good moisturizer and i would recommend this too if you blow your hair out more and you need like a, a moisturizer um or if you got it straightened not to be confused with a silk press but this is kind of like um Y'all remember Pink Moisturizer? That's how this is, like it's kind of thick, creamy, and it smells like Pink Moisturizer. Ironically, that's what made me remember it. But yeah, this is a, a good product for um, blown out state hair. And then for like the miscellaneous edges, twist outs, whatever, Eco Styler Gel. Not just any type of Eco Styler Gel, this Eco Styler Gel. This is my favorite, this is my number one favorite. My second best favorite is the gold, but this one in particular, it gives your hair so much luster and shine and it also moisturizes your hair instead of drying it out. So you know like how most Eco Styling Gels are like water-based, so they don't really like hold the edges like you want them to do. This one does and it moisturizes it and you can easily revert your edges back to regular it doesn't like it's not like a cement hold but it gets the job done and I highly highly recommend this product as well so this one is the black caster and flaxseed oil I got this one for $3.99 $3.99 plus tax but it is a really good product it smells so good too I'm telling you guys all right you guys so that completes my everyday natural guide what I think is best for 4c hair I hope you guys really enjoyed this video oh and disclaimer you can find this shirt on my website at untamedvanity.us for the low low. So if you like this shirt, then I will link all that down below in the description box. And you can also check out other products that I have there. And yeah, go support your girl. As always, comment down below and let me know some of your guys' favorite products that you use on your 4C natural hair. I would love to review them, love to try them. I'm open to it. So yeah, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, turn that notification bell on, and I will see you guys in my next video. Be yourself, be you, be beautiful, and be untamed. Bye.